Yes, and, and, and we have a friend here today. Actually, I, I couldn't get my monkey sitter. Oh. Nah, 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 nah. <laughs> those things are, those are expensive, Actually, monkey sitters. Yeah, those monkey sitters, they're very expensive. Okay, I, I brought him along because, you know, uh, I, he's not doing very well in my class. He's doing very poorly in my class. And uh, he's going to have to do some cramming. Okay. You know, he forgot one little thing. He's like, he's all ready for summer. Look at that. I See, he's know. got his little sunglasses. Got sun his little sunset. Yeah. He's got, lo got sun the little block. stuff on his <laughs> nose, the block, you know. And he's, he's all ready. Bless his heart. Forgot one little thing. Finals. Oh, Duh. I see. <laughs> Monkey's chilling a little too yes, hard. Yes, you know, if he fails those finals, he can kiss Summer goodbye. <laughs> and his grade, too. Yeah, not Summer school. <laughs> oh, darling. <laughs> I ain't going. Well, no, yeah, I'm not going, right. You know, something, if, if uh, he fails his finals, he can spend the rest of Summer in Summer School! Ah. <laughs> da, da, da. <laughs> Yeah, I know he doesn't want to do happen. that. Ain't gonna happen. Yeah, 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 right, Ain't gonna right, happen. Right, okay, right. well, I'll let you get ahead and yeah, help him out with avoiding that <laughs> summer school. <laughs> Ain't gonna happen. Okay, all right. Hi, sweetie. How are you? Ain't gonna happen. Uh, yeah, well, you know, guess what? It's not your decision. Ain't gonna happen. No, 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 no. <laughs> Can I give a shout-out to my homies? Okay, um, you know okay. what? Uh, 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 what what we're gonna do today is uh, we're gonna cram for finals, eh. and I know cramming is not a good idea. Eh. But uh, you know what? The way I do it, it's the most effective way. Yeah. Okay, I use something called the pattern problem, oh. and we have it over here. Cool. Over here. Let's see. Our uh, my vocabulary for today is pattern problem. Oh. <laughs> okay, Shocker. the pattern problem is a simple problem. And you are, it's so simple, you already know the answer to it. Yeah. And what we do is we create the process. Like, do we add? Do we subtract? Do we multiply? Do we divide to get that answer? Oh, you, are you listening to yeah, me? Yeah, I'm all ears. Yeah, right, all ears. I am all ears. Fabulous, okay. And that's one way. And the other, um, other pattern problem is uh, we make, a, a, if we don't know the answer to it, we make a um, model. You're shaking. Uh. <laughs> okay. We make a model of it, and then we figure out the process from the model, okay? So uh, let's uh. look at it and see. How do you learn? Uh, listen, how do you learn? You know, uh. some people learn by hearing it. Uh. Okay. Are you listening? I'm all ears. Yeah, yeah. Oh, shit. Uh. <laughs> some people learn by hearing. Uh. Some people learn by seeing it. Uh. They have photographic memory. Uh. Yeah, right. Some people say, uh, learn by saying it, you know, they teach it to like, you know what, you could teach uh, the process to, um, let's see, one of your superheroes. Oh. Or, or a doll, if you have a doll. You oh. Know. No, not a doll, okay. Nah. All right, a superhero, just line them up and yeah. teach them how to multiply fractions. Yeah. Oh, what a wonderful idea. You oh, got it. Okay, or you, some people learn by writing and some people learn by touching. You know, like touching, oh, look at this, you know what? Um, oh. th isn't this something? Wow. Look at this fabulous thing. Oh, my goodness, Whoa. my goodness. Uh, ooh, oh, my, ah. Look at that. <laughs> Makes a fabulous hat, too. Ah. Gee, uh, I am gorgeous, right? <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay, and look at, I'm touching a pentagon. That's a five-sided figure. I'm touching a triangle. And you see all these little tiny things in here? These are parallelograms that open and close and open and close. Okay. Hey. Fabulous. Oh. Let me see that. <laughs> and w would you like to try right, it? Let's let me see, see that. Let's put that on okay. you right there. Okay. Yeah. It makes a lovely hat. There we okay. go. Oh, looks right. good Is on that me. that nice? Yeah. yeah. Okay. And then. Da. Oh, oh da. sorry. Oh. Da. Oh. Da. Uh, da. Uh, yeah. da. Sorry about that. Da. <laughs> oh. Good. Da. Well. Well, you know, at least you got to touch it. Uh, You're touching it. Oh, that's fabulous. I've got okay. a lawyer. Yeah, uh, you got... I got I'm, an attorney. Yeah, right, you have an attorney. Fabulous. He's going to call you in the morning. <laughs> okay, so we all learn in different ways, okay? Uh, so now, the first problem uh, we're going to do today... Oh, and another uh, thing is, the problem should be... Uh, my goodness uh, gracious. Uh, are, uh, are you okay? Uh, all right, okay, uh, all right, okay. Uh, the problem should be impactful in your life, okay? It should be something that, uh, that benefits you or it affects you in some way. So our first problem is a geometry problem, and it's finding the perimeter of this square right here. See the perimeter of this square? And, um, you know, 
uh, how, how do we remember the word perimeter? Uh, we know that the perimeter is the distance around uh, the figure, okay? The perimeter, you remember that? Don't remember that, huh? Well, we have to have a memory jogger. Sometimes a memory jogger helps. So I think of a fence, a fence made out of peas. You know, like a pea here and another pea, and then there's cross ties and little nails. Okay, so a fence made out of peas. That's my memory jogger. So I remember perimeter and I remember fence. Okay, so Mr. Uh, m m did, did you tell me your name today? What, what is your name? My name is Billy Baru. Oh, my goodness. That's Baru, right. Mr. Baru. That's Mr. Baru to you. Yeah, okay, Mr. Mr. Baru. Okay, fabulous. Okay. Uh, Mr. Baru, do you think that you could tell me the uh, area of this, um, this, uh, re uh, this, tr this square here? Do you think so? Absolutely. Mrs. Baru didn't raise no chumps. Oh, okay. What, what is it right here? This, the area of this right here. What do uh, you think? Uh, uh, 52. 52? Yep. Uh, wrong. Okay, it's not 52. <laughs> okay, uh, maybe it needs to be a little bit more impactful in your life. Let's uh, see. Yeah. Mr. Baru. Yep. You know, it, there's a rumor around that yep. there's this wild animal that hunts monkeys. Oh. Oh, my goodness. Oh. He hunts monkeys. And you know what? Ah. Uh, we might have to just uh, maybe fence in your play area. What do you think? You think so? I have a lawyer. Uh, oh. What does that have to do with fencing in your play he area? He comes after me, I'll stick my lawyer on him. Oh, oh, I'm sorry. Well, you know what? It's not going to do you much good if you're not there oh. anymore. Oh. Okay, so we want to protect you. So we need to build fencing around your play area and right away, right. right away. So now can you look at this and tell me how much fencing? The fence man is out in front. He's got his truck. He's ready. Tell me, quick, quick, quick. I just heard something. How, how, how much? How much? I... Uh, there's 10 here, 10 here, 10 here, and 10 there. Uh, uh, uh. I'm gonna make my brain explode, I don't know. No, well, how about 10 plus 10 plus 10 plus 10? That would be 10 plus 10 plus 10 plus 10. Yeah, but what would it be? Ah, 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 40. Oh, 40, fabulous, thank you so much. Now see, how did you do that? Don't I get something to eat now? No, no. <laughs> Not, not until you're finished, okay? How did you do that? Did you, did you add 10 plus 10 plus 10 plus 10? All right, it was a lucky guess, okay? Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, that's what you did. Now, if you can't remember that, you're, you're gonna have to, you're gonna have to remember it, I'm sorry. You're just going to have to remember it. And you're going to have to remember that you add all the sides when you're trying to find the perimeter. Okay, oh my goodness, okay. Mr. Uh, Baru. <laughs> Ah, okay. Ah. Well, do you feel better now? Oh, I don't think I was supposed to do that. Uh, oh, gee. <laughs> I'm sorry. Wrong. Uh, yes. Well, okay. Mr. Baru, this terrible creature is going to tunnel under the fence. Oh, yes, he's going to tunnel under the fence. So we're going to have to do something about the floor of your play yard, okay? The bottom of your play yard so that he doesn't tunnel up. Uh, my idea is tiling, tiling. Uh, ah. Are you listening? Do you have to touch me so much? Yeah, yeah well, I love you. <laughs> I'm going to tile your play yard, okay? Look at, your, look at this right here. Are you looking? Okay. We're going to tile your play yard with big, heavy uh, cement tile so that he can't dig under and get you. Excellent. Okay. All right. Look at this. Okay. Tell me how many tiles I need to buy. Are you going to pay for this? Yeah. I ain't I'll, coming out I'll of my pay. pocket. I'll pay for it. I'll pay for it. How many tiles do you want? Oh, Four thousand, four thousand. Wrong. Ah. <laughs> what do you say? No. Okay. Look at, look at. Okay. Are you watching? I'm watching. Okay. In order to figure out how many tiles we want, we have ten rows. Look, look. Ten rows. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten rows. Yep. And there's ten in each row. Yep. So ten times ten is what? Oh, here we go again. Ah. Uh, how about 100? That sounds good to me. That sounds good to you. Okay, so what's a fast way of finding this? Instead of having to count all these squares, what am I going to do here? Uh, uh, how about, let's multiply the length times the width. Good if idea. I multiply 10 times 10, would I get 100? Yeah. Yeah, oh, fabulous. Okay, now we're down to the volume, okay? 
Now, remember last week, I gave you a box, a cracker box, and, I, and inadvertently, I left some crackers in it. Mm. And uh, you know what? You had crackers everywhere. So you know what the, the definition of insanity is? Me. Oh, shit, sure, right. No, it's making the same mistake over and over and expecting a different result. Oh. So today I did not bring any crackers. Well, what are you saying? Yes, I brought this itty bitty box. What do you And think? I'm going to fill it up with these little cubes. Oh, now you that's mad. how you figure out the volume of your play yard if we put in a ceiling and some walls. And you know what? Mm. I heard that mm. this, this bad guy, mm. this bad animal, mm. can fly over the fence. Yep. So now we have to wall it in and put a ceiling on it. Bad, and it's going to be 10 feet high, 10 feet wide, and 10 feet long. What, do you got a pterodactyl coming after me? Yeah, oh, yes. This, this is a really cruel, yucky thing. OK, uh, so we need to know how, our, uh, how big this is. And the way we figure it out is we, yeah, right. <laughs> You don't eat these, right? No. It, we fill it up. We fill the whole space inside your play yard up with little cubes, okay? It's just like I'm doing in this box. And we're going to pretend this box is your play yard. See? Filled it up with little cubes, okay? Sounds good to me. And that's what we're going to do here. But we were going to fill that up with cubes that are this size. Oh. This size. Yep. Huge, okay? Yep. So, Billy, oh. Mr. Baru, I'm Ask sorry. Mr. Baru to you. Mr. Baru. Mr. Baru, look at this, oh. and instantly you will be able to tell me how many cubes will go in here. It looks like, ah. no, oh, okay, not instantly, right? Okay, you know how many are in here, Mr. Baru? There are 18 in here, okay? We have, see this right here? Look at this, this is nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and we have two layers here. So that makes 18. Another way of getting 18 is multiplying the length, which is 3, times the width, which is 3, times the height, which is 2. And that gives us 18. Ah! So guess what? Your play yard is 10 times 10 times 10. And what do you think that is? Are you asking me something? Uh, OK. 10 times 10 yeah. is 100 yeah. times 10 yeah. is 1,000. Yeah. OK. Now we have the rule for finding the volume, okay? Fabulous, okay, go back down there and rest, okay? Let's go on to number three. It says decimal numbers, and it says your money, your money. And guess what? I found this money in my dryer right after I started doing your laundry. Show <laughs> me the money. Ah, here it is, Show right here, money. right here. $10 That's my favorite and word. 25 cents Show and 25 cents. Show okay. me the money. Yes, right. Well, there it is. And uh, guess what? It's mine now. <laughs> okay. Yeah, about that. Let's look over here, Mr. Uh, Mr. Uh, Mr. Baru, right here. Okay. We have $10.25 plus another 25 cents. Okay. Money. How much money do you think that's going to be? Money. Ah, you don't get that. Money. Yeah, right. Money. How, how, how much money do you think that would be? Money. $10.25 plus 25 cents. Uh, sounds like uh, a couple of gallons of ice cream to me. Oh, well, yeah, but it's $10.50. Donuts. Okay? All right, but watch, watch. We know it's $10.50, e right? So let's do this. $10 plus uh, 25 cents. Uh, can we do that? Look yeah. at that. Yeah. Before you do the problem, do it wrong the first time yep. because we learn by doing our mistakes, okay? Absolutely. If we added that, we'd have 25 and we would have 35 and we'd have two decimal ah. points. Duh. Yeah. Ah. Wrong. Okay. So let's do it right this time. Ten dollars and twenty-five cents plus twenty-five cents. And we're gonna get ten dollars and fifty cents this time. What do we do different? I'm with you. Are you are you paying yeah, yeah, right. What do we do different here? Oh. How about we lined up the decimal points? There you Did go. Did we do that? Yeah. Okay. A two. Oh, fabulous. Okay. Now, let's go on to uh, our fractions. What? <laughs> okay, all right, oh. fabulous, okay. Oh, well, let's, uh, get. Ah. <laughs> let's get over here, let's, let's, let's do something else, okay? Because I don't seem to be having much luck with your, getting your attention, okay? Uh, here's the rubber chicken today. The rubber chicken is one of our visuals, and it has three plus signs on one side, and it has three negative signs on the other side. 
if you are adding positive numbers, a positive number plus a positive number gives you a bigger positive number. If you are adding negative numbers, a negative number plus another negative number will give you a, a larger negative number. But really, negative numbers are smaller the bigger they get, right? So we're, we'll say it gives you a bigger number with a negative sign in front of it. Okay, fabulous. Okay, now, oh, where are we? Fractions. Now look at here. Mr. Baru, Mr. Baru. Boy, nobody knows me. He took the poor food. Oh. Okay, uh, Mr. Baru, I'm, I'm happy that you're, you're uh, listening to me, you're a music lover, uh, <laughs> but right now, you know what, uh, I figure I could get your attention with food. That was my favorite part. Yeah, yeah, food, can I get your attention with food? Uh, we have pizza over here. Oh. Okay, really, really quick, oh. Mr. Baru, look at this. Uh, we have, look, look, uh, look, we have three quarters of pizza. You're not watching. You don't taste watching. like pizza. No, 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 here it is, right here, right here, right here, okay, three fourths of a piece of pizza mm -hmm. and one fourth of the pizza and all together that gives us how much pizza <laughs> no 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 how many pieces four fourths right does it give us four fourths okay so what's our rule well we keep the bottom number and we add the top numbers okay but now look look down here look look down here we have half a piece of pizza Half of a pizza plus a quarter of a pizza. Oh, oh, what do we have to do? Maybe we have to rename the one half into two fourths. Okay. All right. Uh, can we have a round of applause for our monkey? Oh, my goodness. Yes, yes, yes. Fabulous. Yes, you were just mag magnificent, but not, not really. Show me yeah. monkey. The, yes. <laughs> Here's the money. Oh, God. God. Whatever happened to the gorillas in the mist? I don't know. Uh, just, I, don't, I just don't know. <sighs> I think this is one of them. Yeah, he must have escaped. <laughs> yeah. Anyways. Okay. Summer school for him. Summer school for him. <laughs> okay.